Teacher talking sports, what it does, what it do, how we live in. If I told you that an NFL team lost the offensive yards battle in each of their first nine games, you might say, what's their record? One and eight, two and seven, maybe three and six. How about six and three? I'm talking about the Pittsburgh Steelers who today defeated the Green Bay Packers 23 to 19 as you can see total yards here Green Bay Packers 399 Pittsburgh Steelers 324 outgained by 75 yards but all that matters is the win which brought the Steelers to 6 and 3 you could see just 119 passing yards compared to 283 for the Packers. But their running game did get it going. Both Jalen Warren and Najee Harris having good games. But again, outgained. We take a look at each of their first eight games. So we see opener against the 49ers, outgained 391 to 239. Second game, Browns outgained 408 to 255. Raiders outgained 362 to 333. Texans outgained 451 to 225. Ravens outgained 335 to 202. Rams outgained 354 to 300. Jaguars outgained 377 to 261. Titans, it was close, but they were outgained 340 to 326. And then today, so nine straight games, they have um, given up more yards than they got themselves, and yet they stick at six and three. So via CBS Sports Steelers run past Packers in Week Ten, despite being outgained in yards for ninth straight game. Pittsburgh is the only team to have a winning mark, despite being. They might want to edit this out. Scored in each of its first nine, nine games. They definitely want that to say out gained. So Pittsburgh Steelers are winning in a way that no other NFL team has done in the past 90 years man they need an editor for this uh despite being out game for a ninth straight game the Steelers made enough plays to record a 23-19 win over the Packers on Sunday Pittsburgh six and three now is the only team to have a winning record despite being outscored in oh my gosh despite being out gained in each of its first nine games since the NFL started keeping track of rushing and receiving stats. So, uh, you know, some errors in that CBS Sports article kind of reminds me, I, I just did a video on it where LeBron James compared his Lakers to the Steelers saying they're winning despite being outgained in every game and outscored in every game. Obviously, he was right with the outgain, but um, yes, uh, they... I haven't seen an update, but they were also the only w team with a winning record after being outgained in each of their first eight games. And there had only been 34 teams that had been outgained in their first eight games in NFL history. So I'm sure the le list is even smaller for the first nine games. But the Steelers are 6-3, and three, and with the Browns' comeback victory over the... Uh, Pit, excuse me, Baltimore Ravens, they are just half a game out of first, and they've beaten the Ravens, and they've beaten the Browns, of course, play both of those teams one more time this season, but what are your thoughts, can the Browns keep, up, excuse me, can the Steelers keep up their incredible ways of winning despite being outgained six and three their next game is at cleveland then at cincinnati two big divisional games uh we will see what happens anyhow don't forget to subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe like the video share the video hit the bell for notifications i'm out